found the royal palace at last and rejoins her group of friends. She has met the spirit of Daphne, who has revealed to her new facts. The battle with the giant snow monster and the army of Golem was terrible. Fortunately, the specialists arrived just in time. It's time to go back to Althea. Welcome back, all of you. Bloom, how are you, dear? Fine, Miss Farragonda. So, your mission was successful? We found them, sir. Brandon and his, uh, I mean, Prince Sky and the other specialists. Uh, yes, their arrival on Domino was timely. Hey, oh. look! Looks like Kiko's found a friend. <laughs> it's Pepe, Ice's duck. How did he get here? I brought him with me. Nut. Hmm. It's all right, girls. The ogre is on our side. He fought courageously against the forces of evil. Goodness! You close your eyes for a second and look what happens. <laughs> what? Pepe and I managed to run away what? from Cloud what? Tower. What? They chased <laughs> us, but we were too fast for them. Indeed. We don't even know what happened to Ms. Griffin. So I guess this means we're all in the same boat now. Mm. Yes, but it remains to be seen whether we can keep afloat or not. Well, now at least we have a life raft. Uh-huh. <laughs> It's getting a little crowded here, don't you think? It's true then? Red Fountain Castle was destroyed? Yes, unfortunately. The boys will stay here for now. <laughs> as strong and courageous as these young men are, they can't possibly overpower Icy, Darcy, and Stormy by themselves. <gasps> the whole magic dimension lies in ruin. Those three witches won't wait long before launching a new attack on Althea. We've got to be ready to fight them. That dribbling idiot. <laughs> hey, Stormy, what do you say we play with his head a bit? Just for laughs. <laughs> It can't be real. It's impossible. 
You don't exist. You can't. You are real. Huh? <laughs> All right, big boy. I have no way of defending myself against you, but I won't panic. I don't go down so easily, you know. There are many things I don't like about myself, but I'm far from being a monster, okay? I have a heart. And even though I can't be sure they'll ever be able to forgive me for all the things I've said and done, I have a few friends, too. Hey, kiddo! Huh? Miss Griffin, is that you? What are you doing here? Paying the price for my foolishness. I, too, have shown poor judgment. I should have realized sooner that their ambition was dangerous in scope. But it's not your fault. It would have been impossible to guess what they were planning. Hmm. I've got to try to get out of here. I've always been good at picking locks. This'll do. Hmm. Yes, sir. This'll do the trick, all right. The person hasn't been born yet who can keep me locked up. Don't worry, Miss Griffin. I'll get you out of here in a second. Don't waste your time, kid. Huh? Believe me, if it were as easy as that, my dark powers would have taken care of that lock long before now. It's an ancient runic lock. It's unbreakable. My girls are busy preparing a potion which will allow me to confuse the protection runes for a few seconds. And then... What's happening? The Scrapers, save yourself! But... Run! But you... You can do nothing for me! Run! Where am I? Oh no! No! The window! It's my only chance! There's no other way! Is this where it ends? No! Huh? You'll never get me! Ah! Riven. What's the matter? Hmm? Nothing. I just got this strange feeling. Well, Bloom, we have seriously considered your proposal, and we... Accepted it, and that's why you didn't ask the other Winks to come to this meeting. You mean to say the others know nothing of this? I think it's best if Bloom fills them in. They'll take it better. Excuse me, but what are you talking about? We're discussing Bloom's plan for getting back the Dragon Flame. She hasn't told you anything? <laughs> you are going to accompany this girl to Cloud Tower. What? Only a total lunatic would consider going anywhere near Cloud Tower right now. Exactly. That's the very last thing the witches expect from us. I need to get right into the castle. We have no other choice. How are you going to do that? Easy. We can take the tunnels. Nut is very familiar with the old underground corridor system linking the three magic schools. He will be the one leading us on this mission. Oh, come on, you've lost all of your magic powers. You're putting your life at risk. But I have no choice, don't you understand? As long as the witches possess the power of the dragon flame, nothing can stop them. The flame is a part of me. I'm responsible for it. Bloom. So, when do we get going? As soon as I've convinced Musa, Tecna, and Flora to stay here. Their powers are essential to the protection of Althea. The signs are unmistakable. Look, a final attack is imminent. No! Oh well, he chose his own fate. I would have liked to see him squirm a little longer. Yeah! Well, that's the end of that. Now it is time to seal the fate of Althea. Creatures of the dark! It is time for you to rise! Oradoth Obscuro Tenebrarum. Oradoth Obscuro Tenebrarum. Oradoth Obscuro Tenebrarum. Oradoth Obscuro Tenebrarum. Oradoth Obscuro Tenebrarum.
Rise up from the deep! Emerge from the abyss! Go out into the world! I wish I could help you. Same here. We've already discussed it. You'll be more useful here. Same old story. You're stubborn as a mule. Oh, Flora Musa. <laughs> hey, I'm here too. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <sighs> no. Tecna, are those tears I see in your eyes? Um, no, a speck of dust got in my eye. Excuse me, girls, but time's a wasting and nuts found the right path. Well, let's go. Uh, what is it you say on Earth? Break a leg? And please come back safe and sound. Which way do we go to get to Cloud Tower? I'm not sure. Things are different down here. It's those witches' fault. So, you're not a prince? No, unfortunately. I'm Brandon, Sky's page. So Sky tricked Bloom and you tricked me, is that uh, right? And I suppose it changes everything? Maybe, maybe not. First, let's take care of business, then we can talk about us. What is it, Nut? Did you find something? I don't know. It's just that I feel like we're not alone down here. Relax, Bloom. Stay close to me and nothing will happen to you. I envy you, Stella. You can still defend yourself while I... I've no idea what I'll do when I find myself in front of the witches. Excellent! Everything is going according to plan! 
What are you talking about? Our troops are falling back. I know they are. I want this war to last a long time. I want Althea to suffer a slow, humiliating defeat. The creatures of the dark are numerous and will never give up the fight. So ultimately, they will bring down Althea. <laughs> Three tunnels. Which one do we take? Um, I don't know. What? In the last half hour alone, you've nearly led us into 14 death traps. Stella, Nut is doing his best. Now think. You have a great sense of smell, don't you? It's this one. Are you sure? If I say it's this one, this one it is. is full of smells. Hang on a second, I know that stink. Hey guys, hmm? we've reached Cloud Tower. This isn't what I had in mind. I think this is the castle's garbage dump. Ugh, what a stench, yucko. We've got to find a way out of here and back into the castle itself. Yeah, but first, let's give Nut a hand. Come on. Mm. What was that? I don't know, and I don't want to know. <laughs> oh. Oh, beetle roaches. What are huh? these things? Giant garbage-eating bugs. Ew. Disgusting. Man, there's like an army of them. Well, what are we waiting for? It's extermination time. No, wait! Huh? If we attack them, we run the risk of blowing our cover! True. We get rid of one of them, and the witches will sense it, and that means we can kiss our surprise attack goodbye. Right. We'll stand here and call them names till they go away. Ah, uh, did anyone bring a can of bug spray? <laughs> For a fairy with no powers, you sure pack a punch. Thanks. Look out! Die! Leave him alone, you big... Go on, what you waiting for? Throw it! No, it's moving too much. I'm afraid I'll hit Prince Sky. Oh! Your numbers! Guys, look! They're all going away! That's right. The one I zapped was the leader. Hey, um, who are you, anyway? What? You don't recognize your old friend anymore? Riven! <laughs> I still can't believe it. You managed single-handedly to escape from the dungeons of Cloud Tower. To tell the truth, I didn't get to go very far. Up there, past the dump, the witches have set up a protective shield. If I had gone one step further, they would have captured me. But how did you manage to escape? As I jumped out of the high tower window, I was absolutely sure it was all over for me. But then, a buttress broke my fall and I slid all the way down into the dump. I had to pull myself together. The place was teeming with beetle roaches. I lay low and looked for camouflage and, most importantly, a weapon. The rest of my stay here hasn't been particularly exciting. 
Are you kidding? You had to put into practice everything we learned at Red Fountain. Survival in a zone totally infested with creatures of the dark. Hey, do you remember Kota Tora's lesson? Never hide downwind and keep your fingers out of your nose. <laughs> <laughs> um, Sky, Brandon, I wanted to apologize for all the things I've done. Don't worry about it, buddy. We'll talk about that later, okay? Right. We're on a mission here, let's not forget. So, are you with us? You bet. All right, then. Let's get a move on. Nut has found the tunnel that leads right into the castle. Unfortunately, this doesn't mean we're out of the woods yet, but something tells me our little visit here won't be a walk in the park. In the next episode, at Alfea, the fairies and the specialists are waiting for the Trix's next attack. Bloom's group moves through the corridors of Cloud Tower to get to a room where there is a giant flame. Is that really Bloom's flame? Unfortunately, the Trix will find out that they have visitors.